to you. Ooh, that's beautiful. That's kind. That's the kind of attitude I'm, I'm expecting to be here on, on Nigo. You know, I'm looking forward you know, for all the challenges I'm, I'm going to have here. And the first one is going to be on May 20th, and I'm, I'm looking forward to it. You know, I'm training hard already. And I'll be ready for this. All right. Well, Khabib, you told us from the beginning you were looking to sign the best athletes. And I'm standing next to one of the great heavyweights of all time. What do you expect as it pertains to a heavyweight championship and Junior's path to get to one? And you know, it's like, I think Junior ready for tomorrow, fight for the title, you know. But he have, like, we just signed him. And we want to watch how we're going to deal with uh, De Castro. Because his last fight, it was amazing. He finished first round in first minute, his opponent. You know, this guy is striker, but he can also wrestle and grapple. You know, I think this is a very good test for Junior. And uh, it, for sure, I, I think this fight is going to be a number one contender fight in the heavyweight Ju division. Well, that's big news. I think we just got a commitment. You could be officially the number one contender. Now, speaking of that, before we get to De Castro on May 20th, tonight you're going to be a fan. But you're going to see the heavyweight championship contested for the first time. Do you have a prediction? Well, <laughs> I don't really have a prediction. You know, I'm here to, to enjoy the fights and see the, who's going to be the winner. And then, you know... Uh, after May 20th, I will start thinking about these guys. Right now, I'm just uh, ju I'm just thinking about the Castro. All right, and Khabib, yesterday at the press conference, we had a lot of fun. There was some back and forth. That's why we do press conferences. But the Castro was very respectful of Junior and his accomplishments. De Castro has the power. He's on a little bit of a run. What would it take, and what would it mean for De Castro to get that victory? You know, it's like end of the day, this is all about all about respect. You know, this is mixed martial arts, all about respect. You know, of course, you have to respect legend like Junior Dos Santos because if you're not gonna respect him, you're gonna go sleep in first round. You know, <laughs> but I think it's gonna be a great fight. You know, they both they they have big experience. You know, they both can fight and stand up and um, and uh, they can wrestle. They can do whatever they want. You know, the, I'm very excited about this fight. Like my prediction. Like, I think someone's going to sleep 20th May here in Miami. All right, Junior. I think you might owe me a thank you. I got a commitment from the founder yeah. that you're now in a number one contenders match. But before we get there, as you do see De Castro, who yesterday chose to be polite, he chose to not upset you, how will you be motivated going into that match? Well, I'm looking forward to be back on fighting, you know, man. I, I'm one year already without a fight. So it's been some hard times, you know. I, I, I just... I'm a, I love to be who I am, so I can't wait to be back in, back in there, you know. And once the, the, the door is closed, you know, whatever happens on the outside is on the outside. In there, it's going to be a war, and I'm ready to win that war. You see why everybody likes Junior Dos Santos. Now, guys, for more to come on May.